Khloe Kardashian's customized dream mansion may be in Hidden Hills, but she still often shows off the sprawling California property. Not to mention in spring 2024, it appeared the reality star began even more renovations on the home, even though it was already under construction for two years. From the looks of it, Khloe's making extensive updates to her home's exterior. She moved into the newly built home in 2021 after years of development. She and her mom, Kris Jenner, invested a combined $37 million to build side-by-side -side mansions on the 3.4-acre property they bought in April 2021. Chloe's mega mansion, which she shares with her two young children, offers everything one could dream of, from a fully equipped home gym, a gorgeous movie theater, and the most insane closet you've ever seen. In spring 2024, Khloe Kardashian appeared to be overseeing some more renovations at her already customized mega mansion she calls home. After two years of construction and a reported $17 million just to build, Khloe's dream property was ready to move in, located right next door to her mom Kris Jenner's home. Khloe's family estate is located in the ultra-exclusive guard-gated community of Hidden Hills, California, an area which the Kardashian-Jenner clan is known to love. Khloe moved into the newly constructed home, built on a 10,000 square foot lot in 2021 after a couple long years of development. She and her mom invested a combined $37 million to build side-by-side -side mansions on the 3.4-acre property they bought in April 2021. Chloe reportedly spent $17 million to create her dream home, while Chris invested over $20 million on hers. Chloe's home reportedly offers eight bedrooms, 9.5 baths, and every amenity you could ever imagine. There's an eight car garage, covered patios, guest house, and much, much more. Chloe gave fans a peek at the interior during an episode of her family's reality show in 2022. Chloe said at the time, it's amazing to finally see this become a tangible home. We're so excited that this is where we get to create all our memories and put down roots. This is mine. While Chloe initially planned to live here with her baby daddy and on and off again boyfriend Tristan Thompson, the two had split following his paternity scandal. While Tristan briefly stayed with Chloe while his own home was being renovated, she now mainly shares the space with her children, True and Tatum. Tristan actually purchased a home three doors down while Chloe's mom, Chris, is her next door neighbor. One of her home standout features is the garage turned pantry, which Chloe describes as effing amazing, and I have to say it is. Look at that organization. Kourtney Kardashian has also highlighted her sister's meticulously organized pantry on her poosh blog, showing the labeled glass cookie jars and a dedicated baking section. The home edit team who worked with Chloe on the dream pantry reflected on the project on Instagram, calling her the queen of organization. They shared how they custom stained backstock baskets, dispensers, and jars to create a cohesive look throughout the space while ensuring maximum functionality. Now, another space in her home that Chloe is super passionate about is her impressive home gym. Chloe often shares glimpses into her workouts on social media taking place in her gym, which boasts a rolling machine, other equipment, flat screen TVs, and numerous mirrors. She not only has private training sessions there, but also has been seen working out with her sisters, including Kim. Chloe's mansion also features a stunning home theater with multiple couches and a massive screen. In an episode of The Kardashians, she showed the room to her daughter, True, who immediately asked for the remote. When Chloe first showed off her massive walk-in closet, she admitted she didn't even want to walk inside. The scene gave viewers a peek at her impressive shoe collection, shelves filled with Birkins and designer luggage. Talk about dream closet. As she toured the rest of her home, including the living and dining rooms, Chloe described the vibe as clean, chic, and beautiful. Chloe chose a color palette of mainly beige and neutral tones, reflected in her chairs, bedspread, and couches. However, her favorite piece in the house is actually a photo of her late father, Robert Kardashian. 
Chloe's master suite is painted in a soft neutral beige with a large flat screen TV mounted on the wall across from the bed while there's also a cozy fireplace nook with shelves boasting family photos. In 2023, Chloe also shared how she updates her decor for the holiday season on Instagram, posting a video of multiple Christmas trees and garlands lit up around her fireplace, as well as a luxurious dining room setup. Out back, of course, there's a swimming pool with inset spa, as well as a tree-lined walkway and plenty of space to entertain. In addition to the expansive pool and gardens, Chloe's backyard features a long pergola draped in roses, offering a shaded path between a reflecting fountain and a spacious bench in the distance. Back in 2020, she put her longtime home in Calabasas on the market and sold this place for $15.5 million in an off-market deal to YouTuber Darman. That was more than double what Chloe paid for it in 2014. During her ownership, Chloe carried out a major renovation of this home, which she showed off in an architectural digest. Some of the highlights included a designer eating kitchen, a silver tone screening room, a fully equipped glam room, and a walk-in closet that was built from two bedrooms. The backyard offered a sparkling swimming pool, a patio with swinging day beds, and a courtyard complete with a fireplace. For today, that's going to wrap up our look into Khloe Kardashian's dream home. What was your favorite custom feature of her place? Thanks for watching. I'm Care the Vampire Slayer. Follow me on Instagram to chat, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.